uh, Roxanne had just went and she had tossed her, um, well, she had made her staff into a spear by putting her little dagger on top of it. And then she had recalled it. Uh, yeah. She was trying to hit the thing behind you and then she missed and hit you instead. But then she recalled it and it is the skeleton's turn uh, right after her. It's the only skeleton left. So it's the one that is to the left of Wyatt. Skeleton's going to swing. Does a 15 hit. No, it doesn't. Zombies are going to go after Arrow. Just barely. Three bludgeoning damage from that. Sick. So that's all the zombies. The Mummy Lord's turn. Turn, he has to make a con save. That's the one where uh, nothing happens, right? Yeah, it's all or nothing. No, he hasn't taken any damage yet, so he's not really going to do anything. Yeah, he uh, keeps having crazy con saves. Yeah. Um, he is a lord. True. So, so then it is, uh, it is Lord's turn. Yeah, there's three zombies. They're surrounding uh, Arrow, and then there is one of the shadowy boys behind Arrow. There is also a shadowy boy making their way over to Arrow. Um, there's a skeleton to your left, Wyatt. I'm going to aim for the skelly. Just barely. Sweet. And then I'm going to try and attack him again if he's not dead. I got a nat one. Yeah. You're aiming high, and the uh, the arrow bounces off of the, one of the rocks here. And you're gonna you're gonna hit arrow. Sorry, that won't happen again. I'm gonna hit you next. Okay, you too, um, rock Dan. You better stop. Take a third, a third uh, try. Oh, uh-huh. and that is a nat twenty. So yeah, Isle of Bones. Sweet. All right, now I'm gonna be aiming for the uh, shadow boy near arrow. Hits. Uh, okay, yeah. So you see it kind of like um, it like looks to the side real quick at. Uh, the mummy lord, because it, it thinks that it hears something, and then it just goes, and then you see it like separate from the rest of its body. All right, I'm just gonna pick the one that's closest to Arrow then. To that one, why it's like taken taken down the baddies, but also doing <laughs> a lot of damage. He's not meaning to. Uh, Shizeno, you're gonna take ten piercing damage. It kind of like ricochets. Thanks, Wyatt. I'm, I'm getting a little sloppy. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, that's the end of my turn. All right, it's Abby's turn then. I am going to stick with Shizeno. Riveting stuff from me, I know. I will ready my movement action that if Shizeno moves... Actually, no, I'll take the dodge action. They have disadvantage if they try to hit me. That'll be my turn. It's Shizeno's turn. How are you looking, Arrow? Pretty bad. I'm bloodied and there's an arrow sticking out of me. I need you to trust me. Take a hit. Oh, I will. <laughs> that's it. I'm going to attack the closest. Um, this thing seems like it's on its uh, its last leg. All right. And then I'm going to use my extra attack to hit it again. Uh, it's a nat 20. Um, yeah. So like with this like big like slashing arc, you uh, you lob one of them in half. Your like wide slice uh, kind of nicks the side of one of the, the fall on to the other one. Then the other wraith is going to come over to Arrow and they're going to miss. Roxanne's turn. Yeah, she's going to try and throw her spear again. That misses. Okay, so she, she throws it and it falls at the, the bottom of the, the wraith. And then she uh, she goes, whoops. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, I'll yell up to her. You almost got it that time. <laughs> and then uh, zombie's turn. You're going to take two bludgeoning. No? Sorry, me and Arrow are going to switch spots. And I'm going to nullify two damage. Oh. So zero. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, then it is the... You, you thought two was bad? <laughs> the other zombie's turn. So that zombie misses. Um, then it is the Mummy Lord's turn. What's his name? Todd? Mm-hmm. He's going to be like, oh, thank you. Those things were annoying the hell out of me. <laughs> Here's a bunch of gold and uh, some heals. They were siphoning all my power. <laughs> nope. He's not doing anything yet. Was uh, it his turn? Yeah. Oh, yeah. The Constitution. Same. Then it is Wyatt's turn. It's still a bunch of zombies surrounding Arrow, correct? Surrounding me now. I think only two okay. and the phantom shadowy figure. No, I took down the shadowy figure that was there's, near there's Arrow, another didn't one I? That showed up in the same spot. I'm gonna go for the uh, the wraith again or the shadowy figure. Shoot me! It's like a twenty-five. That's five damage. Then I'm gonna try and hit it again. Eight, which I'm guessing does not hit. I'm gonna try for it again. Eleven, which I'm guessing doesn't hit. That's not hit. One more. That one does hit. Abby's turn then. If you're not moving or anything. Um, now the arrow is get 18 health back. So back to not being bloodied. The yeah, blood sucks so. back up into my cuts and they close. And I give you like a little rub on the back because it's touch range. Uh, yeah, and I, uh, 
Uh, yeah. Cast cure wounds. Shizeno's turn. So I got two zombies and a shadowy figure next to me. Yep. Does the shadowy figure look more damage than the, zo- the zombies do? Looks like a raid. Or, or is she fine? One of the zombies. The other zombie is being a rotting flesh thing. Zombie that looks injured then. That does not hit. I use my extra attack. That one isn't that one. When you miss, you like slam down very hard and you uh, you hit your foot. Raise wang doodling themselves today. Yep. I'll Kadama come, come give it a poke, I guess. The zombie? The, the same zombie. I mean, he'd have to fly over, but I think he should be able to get there pretty easily. Well, yeah, flying 50 feet. Yeah, you should be able to get there easy. Yeah, that hits. 1d1 damage. <laughs> Um, he always rolls way higher than me. He does a one damage. <laughs> All right, then it is Arrow's turn. All right, I'm going to run back down to the other side of the wraith uh, where I was before. Oh, okay. Because it's the other wraith came up where the other wraith was before, right? Yeah. Yeah, so I would if I came down the stairs and went up to him, I'd be on the other side of him that I was previous, right? Yep. Yeah, I'm going to do that. And, uh, do I have a... Do I, can I still attack or is that... It? Yeah, yeah, that's just... Uh... All of your movement. Uh, yeah, that hits. And I'm going to use my branding smite as a bonus action. It seems like though, when you you're slicing with your the the fire, um, it kind of gets uh, doused pretty quickly, and it only takes uh, half the amount of fire damage. Uh, my turn's over. Their turn. They are gonna turn around and slash at you, arrow. Hell no. Okay, so that's a miss. And then it is Roxanne's turn. Um, Stick my tongue out at it. When it misses. <laughs> All right, so she's going to aim for that. And let's see if she hits it this time. Nope. <laughs> she missed. So it lands next to it again. Wow, her. You get the Roxanne is not a fighting centric character. <laughs> She's not. Well, if she does hit, the, her thing will do pretty good damage. Um, and then she uh, she recall she sticks her hand out and recalls it. Um, she says, "Well, I, I thought third time would be the charm, but I guess not." <laughs> it's okay. Keep trying. You'll get it. Um, and then it's the zombies' turns. She's an L. How about a seven? <laughs> that one got me. Uh, okay. It's weird, but mummy lord's turn. They got to make a con save. Yeah. I'm going to use my portent so the dice roll is a six. Nice. He does fail then. Yay! <laughs> He's going to take four d10 radiant damage and suffer one level of exhaustion. Seven. Oh. <gasps> Now he's been hit, he's getting mad, and he's going to go for Abby. 17, so. <laughs> 27, 32 radiant damage. Nice. Suffer one level of exhaustion, assuming he can. He's going to emit a dim green light so that he cannot benefit from being invisible. He is immune to the exhaustion. Um, is he immune to exhaustion because he's already dead? Yeah. Uh, that's what I'm guessing anyway. So remember how he was looking at you before? I'm going to need you to make a wisdom saving throw. Does that pass or fail? Uh, That passes. Okay, cool. If it failed, I could have added to it, but I have to know ahead of time. I mean, if it failed, that would be a big uh for us. It's a tie. Then it is uh, Wyatt's turn. I'm going to try and hit some zombies that are left. Although the shadowy thing is probably more important because its arrow doesn't have much health. I'm fine. Okay. Okay. I'm fast. Okay. You can't hit we'll me. go for the shadowy boy. We'll go for the shadowy boy then. <laughs> Maybe you should have gone for the zombies. So I'm closer to those than I are. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> now arrow's going to get shot. <laughs> Don't shoot your damn arrows anywhere near me. <laughs> <laughs> What's the likelihood? Every time you roll another one, multiply it by 20. We're very mad about it. It's an out one. So, wow. just fired directly into my head. <laughs> These are cursed dice. Which zombie were you uh, aiming at? I was aiming at the rain. I wasn't oh, aiming yeah. at a zombie. I was aiming at oh, the sorry. shadow. Okay. Um, yeah, I talked her naming at the shadow because. Arrow, arrow is in da- danger, and now she's going to shoot arrow. I'm in more danger if Wyatt shoots arrows near me. Right. Wyatt's going to kill me before the yeah, bad guys say, do. How much damage has Wyatt done who, versus who, everyone? Who wants high and who wants low? Shizeno, do you want high or low? I don't know. I, I, arrow you pick. You're the one who's injured. Take low. It's going after Shizeno. Oh, this take... is also the only way I can take damage because <laughs> he's going right through my AC. It's going to be six points of piercing damage. I, okay. I have damage exclusively from that ones at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay I'm going to try an attack. I've taken almost 30 points of damage from that ones. All right, next attack. Guys. <laughs> no f- are, are these weighted <laughs> dice? <laughs> I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> Um, I mean, it's a nat one. <laughs> How is that possible? I don't know. 
no. I'm not doing anything. Kristen no red right now. Shazeno, you're gonna take nine more points of uh, piercing Jesus damage. Christ. Yeah, I'm sure everybody. <laughs> no. I have taken 34 damage from that one. Oh my god, it's so hot. I'm gonna open the window after this. Oh gosh. Okay, one more time, I guess. That hits. It hits the target yeah. that you were aiming at, yeah. not someone else. Yeah, 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 yeah. It kind of oh. slows down as it goes through it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Love, that. Love that. Okay, well, that's the end of my turn, and I'm going to open a window. <laughs> hey, Wyatt, do you want to do some target practice with me when we get back? Yeah, that sounds that sounds wonderful. I'd love that. <laughs> Two things happen. One, skeletons that you saw uh, facing the uh, pedestals rip themselves out of the sides of this pyramid, uh, the, the mini one in the center. There are six of them. Or you would guess there's six of them because you hear it from the other sides, but you only see the two that are near you. Shizeno and Arrow, you're going to need to ta- make a constitution saving throw. Did I get advantage on that? I can, wait, it's a spell, right? No. Why did, I, why did I say it? Why did I say it? I don't get advantage on it. Um, so you're both blinded um, as this mummy is surrounded by this swirling sand uh, and dust uh, all around him and like uh, kind of like engulfing you a little bit. How many things can I hit in a forty-foot cube? Uh, yeah, I mean, you could you could probably hit them all. Uh, actually, you'd miss four of the skeletons. You'd you'd miss the two on the back side of the the mini pyramid and two on the um technically the the pyramid's left side, but it's opposite of where you're facing. I'm gonna cast slow. Everything that's within it has to make a wisdom saving throw. That good allies. Uh, six creatures of my choice, so I'm not going to target any of you. So I'm guessing Mummy Lord and Wraith at least. Yeah, two most important, yes. All right. Um, there's the two zombies, and you'll hit two skeletons. So, oh, that's all six. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Let's do Mummy Lord first. Um, that's an at one. Hell yeah. Um, then let me do the that. zombies. I'll just have them roll at the same time. But that's going to fail. Skeletons. Everyone fails. Okay. Uh, their speeds are halved. They take a negative two penalty to AC and dex saving throws. They cannot use reactions. Uh, on its turn, it can either use an action or bonus action, not both. Regardless of its abilities or magic items, it can't make more than one melee or ranged attack on its turn. Uh, if it attempts to cast a spell with a casting time of one action, it has to roll a d20. 11 or higher, the spell doesn't take effect till the... Oh, I roll a d20. Okay. If I roll 11 or higher, it doesn't take effect till next turn, uh, and then it's completed. It can make another the end of each of its turns on a successful save all of this ends. I'm guessing it's the end of your turn? Yes. But the one thing I haven't been paying attention to is if people are moving or not. I moved. I was the one, only one next to you, I think, and I moved back down to the wraith. Feel free to come down and stand behind me. I'll take the hits. Uh, Shizeno's turn. So me and Arrow have disadvantage on attacks, right? Yep. So say I have an ability that would let attack at advantage, would it just be at regular? Or yeah. would it just be at advantage? Regular. All right. Well, I'm going to use Might on Arrow, and I'm just going to say, finish that thing off and point at the Wraith. Or sorry, shadowy figure. So you can make one attack with your weapon. Is this Wraith bloodied yet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they were bloodied um, before. You're also going to add four, four to the uh, damage if you hit. 28 hits. This is your reaction, by the way. No uncanny dodge this round for me. Yeah. How many turns does my power up last for? Probably four. Uh, yeah, at least that. Oh, no, so I don't. I don't think I have any more eyes left. Well, I do, but I don't want to be exhausted. What, what, would, what does exhaustion do? The first level is disadvantage on ability checks. The second is half speed. If you use the last two eyes, you, do, you it's one level of exhaustion per eye, so you could only get a max of two anyway. When it powers down, does it power down from third, the third power, third mode, or does it power, like, does it go all the way back down to the regular mode, or does it just stop being on fire? It being a katana is the... the thing for how long that lasts whenever that ends fire ends as well yeah so it's just a regular old angle sword now mm-hmm. i mean it'll still count as a magical weapon but right. yeah it's gonna take six slashing the shadowy figure right, yeah this thing's uh spewing lots of shadowy mist so is that the end of shizeno's turn yeah if there's anything else i can do uh kadama can go give him a poke a little, little phantasm boy. Although I, he'll take half of one. Yeah, but minimum of one, so. Oh, okay. Give it a shot. Does not hit. How, how do you get rid of the blind again? It, it just only lasts until the end of your next turn. So you're good. 
you like rub the sand out of your eyes. Yeah, so then it is Arrow's turn. Swing my sword at it. 15 hits. How do you want to kill it? Slice it down the middle the long way, like hot dog. <laughs> hot dogs. Yeah, it looks like it's going to come back together, but then it just like dissipates. Um, the first zombie, it takes seven psychic again. Can I get to the zombie? Well, for one, can I move if I'm blind? Yeah, you can move. Um, can I get to, can I like shimmy around Shizeno and get to the zombies? Or am I stuck behind Shizeno? Uh, you are not behind Shizeno. Shizeno was, is technically in front of you because you were both like facing the um, the shadowy figure. You could easily get the one that's like diagonal to you, which is on Shizeno's left. And that, or you can go around the other way and get the one behind her. I'm going to throw my A sword at that one. Uh, you, you, do you want to throw it? Because you're like you're like at an angle, so you, you're right next to it, essentially. Yeah, just, I'll just, hit, I'll just, just diagonal. Okay. Smack him then if I can reach him. Yeah, that hits. Nice. How do you want to kill this zombie? Lights his head up. Yeah, the goopy mess. And then the one behind him is going to take uh, ten psychic damage. I got two more of those, but it only works when I do a sneak attack. Is it the end of your turn? That is the end of my turn. Yeah. All right, Roxanne's gonna. She's actually gonna jump down there so she just kind of instead of taking the stairs she just jumps over the edge she casts a spell and then jumped sorry she does like hero landing she's gonna attack the uh the zombie just enough just so this thing looks bloodied now you see uh two skeletons come from actually i guess four skeletons come from behind the pyramid two on the right two on the left the two that are on the the face here that you're you're facing one goes to attack Shizeno, one goes to attack Arrow. My hit. That does not hit me. Zombie is going after Roxanne now that she's down here and did some damage. All right, that's a hit. Uh, Roxanne looks bloodied from one one hit from this zombie. From the zombie? Mm-hmm. No good. Is she like level one? She's <laughs> level two. Mommy Lord's turn. He's going to stand up towards Shizeno. Speed is half. I don't like that. I mean, he, he's basically like right next to... Yeah. All right. So he is next to you. He's going to... So he's going to try to punch you. That is. Make a constitution saving throw. Yeah. You feel like really uh, like just not exhausted, but um, you almost feel like like you have really bad luck, like almost like you're cursed. Yeah. I mean, that's how I felt this whole fight. So. <laughs> yeah. So basically uh, you can't regain hit points. Your hit point maximum decreases by 11. I mean, I'm not even close. To, like I'm down like 60 points at this point i know we're near my maximum and for every 24 hours that goes by it will go down by 11 yeah how do i get rid of it i, I assumed this was to the end of the fight <laughs> the curse lasts until removed by the remove curse spell great and I, I lose 11 now uh yes and then for every 24 hours after that okay i'm not good i'm bad off I mean, I probably still have more health than any of you have max, but <laughs> not compared to my maximum, I'm not good off. Um, there's also, if you die this way from losing health this way, there's an extra thing that happens. I take it I've become one of the dudes that are fighting. I you never it's know. Max. I have more higher max health than you. What? Why? Because <laughs> I did tough. I have 52. Is that the, the feat that gives you one for every yeah. level you are? Yeah. You get more, you get like, I think it's like 10 and then one plus every level, something like that. Then it's Wyatt's turn. Let's get to shooting some zombies. One, right? Yeah, just the one. One Okay, we'll go for that. Skeletons and Todd. Six skeletons? I think there's only two that are within range. No, they're they're all in range now. Do I see any more skeletons on the walls? Uh, It's not immediately apparent to you that there are any more. We'll go for the zombie. That hits. I'm going to try again. That hits. How do you want to kill the zombie? I want to, I want to slice it in half through the tummy. Not, Not hot dog, dog. hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, so you, you like shoot this thing from afar and uh, it, it like rips apart like a part of it and uh, that makes it like f- kind of fold in half. Just I like love that. right right in front of Roxanne and she goes, Ooh. One more is going to go towards uh, the nearest skelly. I miss it. All right. End of my turn. Wyatt, the mummy lord, is going to look at you. I mean, I guess I'll just take the dodge action, even though I'm not near anything. <laughs> Only have concentration or touch spells. That's all you're doing for your turn? Yep. Shizeno's turn. There's a big yeah. mummy lord standing in front of you. He's like nine feet tall. I'm just going to say, like, Todd, what the hell? Uh, I'm going to guess he does not acknowledge that I'm talking to him. No. That I'm trying to hit him with my Akamaki. does not hit. Know. It, like, I clangs know. off of some of his, uh, his like... Uh, filigree armor that he's wearing. I'm gonna try again. No, that does not hit. Mark it out and kill him. Nope. Rips off. 
Azir. You don't want him to eat the eyes. Arrow, your turn. There's a big uh, mummy lord next to you. I'm going to power up. I'm going to do it. All right. One level of exhaustion, right? Yeah. So what is that? Minus another 10 HP. You're going after the mummy lord? Yeah. The heads. Yeah, so you, you managed to like his like cloth that has like the, the mark of Ta on it, and he looks at you angrily. Do you want to look at him and go like this? Is that your turn? I'm going to do my extra attack as well. Let me roll psychic damage on the other zombie. It's still alive. Its head explodes. Oh, also, he looks uh, bloodied. The mummy lord? Yep, that hits. You uh, slash. First, you slashed, like, across um, and down, and you cut part of his, like, cloth. Go to cut him into the side. He tries to block it, and you uh, you actually chop off one of his arms. I have one more smite that I can use. I guess I'll save it, and that's my turn. Then it is Roxanne's turn. She's going to throw her spear at the mummy lord. Five piercing damage. Then it is these skeletons. So two of them will go for Zeno. Three and a 22. 22 is. The skeleton roll the 22? Yeah. Damn. Other two that are coming around the other side are going after Arrow. No, 14 does not. What about a 16? 16 does not hit either. All right. Then we got these other two. So that hits. Roxanne. She has one HP left. This other skeleton's going to go after her. Oh, no. That is, oh, just barely hits. Uh, so, yeah, she's down. That's not fine. She flips to the ground as one of these skeletons just like Get out of space. double-handedly slams down on her. Oh, <sighs> Lord's turn. All right, it's going to attack Arrow. Actually, because you uh, you cut its little claw thing and chopped one of its hands, it's going to stare at you. I need you to make a wisdom saving throw. You are frightened until the end of the mummy's next turn. Not be frightened by this enemy if he's undead. Is he undead? He's undead, right? Yep. Yeah, he can't frighten me. And he, he sees that, like, if this has no effect on you and goes to punch you in the gut. He accidentally goes to punch with the, the hand that he f- forgot that he just uh, lost. It's got a nat yeah. one. That face of disappointment you made, Chase, almost makes me feel like you want me to die. <laughs> <laughs> Why? We're going to. There's still skellies around, correct? Yep. We're going to shoot some skellies. It's going to be like. Psh, 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 psh. I bet you if Todd dies, the skeletons will cease to exist. Okay, okay, I'll go for Todd then. I'll say, I'll, I'll say to the group, this is, this is how we'll make it in game. I'll say, they keep shooting skellies, or you want me to go for Todd? Shoot Todd. I think he's on the rope. I think I got him on the ropes. All right, let's try it. That misses. It, yeah, it like yeah, no pings kidding. off of one of his little armor things. My next one is twenty-one. That hits. I could have been using my weird glass eye. Still use that. Yeah. yeah. Sweet. I get to roll on the beholder table each day. Okay, I want to use a beam. I want to use a beam. I don't want to absorb, so that doesn't matter. It's a five. Let's see. Enervation ray. The target creature must take a D16 constitution saving roll, taking 36. Necrotic damage on a failed save or half as much damage on a successful one. That's lit. It's probably going to use necrotic, but go ahead. <laughs> yep. Um, so... so. Can what we, like, your, pretend... Your, your He's already dead. <laughs> Can we pretend that it wasn't that? That's, that's probably... Uh, that's, like, the worst thing you could have rolled in this situation. Because it's it's immune, so it basically just did nothing. Whether it passes or fails, it's not going to affect it. <laughs> right. So you see this, like, dark green energy, like, shoot out of this thing and making, like, a huge, like, zappy noise through the air. And then it, uh... Just goes and fizzles once it touches the uh, the mummy lord. I don't like this game. Ain't that just the way? You're not the hero at this point. We've, we've taken more damage from you than the enemy. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I could have redeemed myself. Like, uh, so what did that do? How, how about this, Kristen? Yeah, that's cool. You want to use your inspiration point? You can reroll. <laughs> I do. I do. Well, I do. I do. Make I sure do, you I remove do. that first. What a benevolent DM. Well, you'd never use your inspiration, so. I bet you he's immune to this one, too. It's a three. It's the fear array. The targeted creature must succeed a D16 wisdom saving throw or be frightened for one minute. The target can repeat the saving throw at the end of each of its turns, ending the effect on itself in a success. <laughs> Yeah, sorry. <laughs> the Lord is probably immune to being frightened. Too. Yeah. <laughs> probably the two things that he's immune to. That and exhaustion. I guess I'll just slink back into not doing anything. My I'll, And I'll end my turn. <laughs> I mean, it's a successful turn. You didn't hurt anyone. <laughs> right. 
Valid. Wow, those are some really cool lasers. I bet he's really hurting now. Because <laughs> in my mind, that did a lot of damage. <laughs> I'll say, yeah, probably. How close am I to arrow? Like, direct line of sight would be um, 30, but you can get down to her in, like, 25. If I'll use a fourth level cure wounds on arrow, and then, yeah, I'll just stick behind her for now. Kill him if you can, but also maybe be my bodyguard so we can go save uh, Roxanne in a second. Yeah, she doesn't look so good. She's in turn, then. Don't worry, have anything about my Nagamaki, so there we go. That misses. That one. You kind of, like, wildly swing in anger at this thing, and you're going to hit arrow for 11 slashing. That's more damage than I do. I can't even do 11 slashing. <laughs> Damn, I'm really mad, I guess. Kadama. That does not hit. Yeah, I've, I've definitely taken more damage from myself and Wyatt than anything else right now. It is uh, Arrow's turn then. I'm going to swing at this boy again. Guess who got a nat one this time? Shizeno. You're going to take six slashing damage. Extra attack. That hits. How do you want to kill him? I just want to cut his head off. You cut his head off and he says, it's ta, not ta. And then he dies. Just as you cut off his head, all of the skeletons crumble to dust, mm. as does the mummy lord. Do it. What did you say? It's Todd. He said it's not Todd. It's Todd. It's it's Todd. It's not, it's not Todd. It's Todd. But if we're not in initiative, I'm going to cast a second level heal on Roxanne. Okay. She's back at full health. <clears throat> <laughs> I rolled really low on my <laughs> fourth level to heal arrow, then really high on my second level. Am I just going to get real sick real fast? Uh, make me a wisdom roll. That's not good. Yeah, you're not sure. You just feel bad. I had a feeling. You're like, I got a flu or something. Yeah, I'm just going to keep queasy from the fight. Mm-hmm.